Hey guys, so today's just going to be a vlog, just what's going on in my life right now. It's primarily going to be all about my whole driving test that I took today. So, okay. So, I took my driving test today and I passed and I was just so surprised. I really thought I was going to fail. Like, I was preparing myself to fail because, I don't know, I always take things more seriously than they are and I always think they're going to be so much worse. That's just the type of person I am. But, um, it went pretty smoothly. I only made a few mistakes, but I'm just going to tell you about my whole day, how the whole thing went. So today at school, I was like a mess. Like some of my friends seriously thought I was going to have like a nervous breakdown. I'm not even joking. Like every five seconds I'd be talking about it. And they're probably really annoyed with me because I was probably being really annoying because I don't know. I just get like that. I get really nervous about like just little stupid things, but I don't know. I just didn't want to have to wait like three more weeks to get my license. I just really wanted it. I was just really ready. Um, like I wasn't scared for like the whole driving aspect of it because every time me and my mom like drove in the car, I'd always be the one to drive. She'd let me drive all the time. But um, parallel parking, on the other hand, like I went like three or four times. So it's not a lot. And I wasn't like, I didn't know it like, like, I wasn't sure I was going to get it, ev like, perfectly every single time. Like, I wasn't, I don't know, I wasn't at a place with myself where I knew I was going to be doing it perfectly, like, for the test, you know? So, I was just really nervous going in at the test, and, um, so I got this guy, and he looks kind of mean, and, I don't know, he was kind of mean, but not that, not really, he passed me, but... Okay, so first, I don't know if you guys have to parallel park for your driver's test, but in my state, you have to parallel park first, and then you just have to drive, and um, parallel parking is, like, the first thing you do, so, yeah, um, I really, I just didn't want to, I don't know, I just really wanted to pass, and, uh, but, so I went parallel parking, and surprisingly, it went really smoothly. The only thing I did wrong is... When, like, you're pulling out of your spot, you had to put your, um, traffic signal on, like, to the left so you're, like, so the other cars know you're pulling out. But I didn't do that because I forgot. I was just really nervous. That was my whole, like, they were the only mistakes I made. We're not using my traffic signals, like, two times. But, um, besides that, I did pretty good. Um, so parallel parking went fine. And I was, from that point, I was just, like, relieved because I'm, like, you know, I could do this. I know how to drive good. I'm going to be fine. But actually, I did worse on the driving part because, um, okay, so everything was going good. I was really conscious about my speed because, like, my friends told me, you know, just don't go one thing over the speed limit because you will fail. So every, like, two seconds, I was looking down at my speed. And um, everything went good um, until we had to get in this one area where you make a U-turn. And I misunderstood him. I thought you had to make a U-turn around all these cars, but it was just, like, a U-turn, like, I don't know, it's hard to explain, but he was, like, yelling at me, he's, like, whoa, whoa, you're doing the wrong thing, and I was, like, oh, my God, I'm so sorry, so, yeah, I don't know, I, like, misunderstood him a lot of times, he probably thought I was, like, really dumb or something, but whatever, <laughs> okay, so, um, everything went fine, um, the other time I forgot to put my directional on was, when I was at, like, a yield sign, I don't know, I guess you were supposed to put your directional on and I forgot, but I don't know. I really don't care that I made those mistakes, though, because I have my license, so that's all that matters. But um, I'm just so happy. Like, it hasn't really hit me yet. Like, I don't realize, like, I could just get in a car and just go somewhere without waiting for my mom. But the only thing is I just don't have my car yet, and um, I don't know what car I want yet. Like... I'm thinking about getting a Volkswagen Jetta, a white one, because I like the black ones. I like black cars a lot, but, like, I'm going to want black cars when I get older, and I'm not going to want black cars my whole entire life. So, that's why I'm thinking about getting a white one, but I'm not sure yet. I don't know. But, um, if you guys have a car, um, put it in the comments and tell me what car you guys have, um, if you're, like, around my age, because I just really don't know what car I want yet, um, like, I'm on a budget and stuff, like, I, I'm getting a used car, I'm not getting, like, a new car or anything, but I'd be way too scared with a new car, I think, anyways, but, um, 
I just really don't know what I want yet. But my mom wants me to get like a Ford Focus or whatever, but I don't know. They're okay. But um, yeah, so that's the whole driving thing. I'm just so happy right now. Like I just really can't even put it into words. I'm just so happy. But um, another thing that's going on in my life now is um, in my five in my five facts video, I said how um, I get bored of things easily, and I told you guys how I quit track in ninth grade. Well, I quit track again this year. Yeah, I was just after two practices, I was sick of it. The coach probably barely knew I was on the team because I went to like two practices, but. Yeah, so I'm done with track. Um, yeah, whatever. Field, ho I'm, field hockey is just the only sport I'm going to do anymore because that's the only one I stick with because I just love field hockey. But, um, yeah, but um, I have a gym membership. So when I get my car, I'm just going to be using that a lot. And um, I need to get a job because I want extra money to spend. So, yeah, just a lot of stuff going on right now. Um, I'm getting my brace, my bottom braces off, my next brace place appointment. That's where I go to get my braces. It's called Brace Place. But, um, yeah. So I'm really excited about that. I'll probably have to wait a little bit um, longer for my top braces. But just to get, like, one part of them off is just so nice. Because I have braces for two years. I had them for two years in ninth grade. And pretty much two years um, my 11th grade year, which is this year. So I'm just really ready to get them off, like, but I don't want them to, like, be taken off if they're not perfect. Like, I had them on for so long that I just want my teeth to be perfect. And I don't care if I had to wait a few months more because I just want my teeth perfect after this, you know? So, um, that's pretty much going what's going on in my life right now. Um, I went to Dunkin' Donuts. That was my first destination for um, getting my driver's license. So, I got hot chocolate. This was, like, the only thing I could afford because I had, like, $2 in my purse, but... Yeah, I'm done now, unfortunately, but yeah, so my mom has a meeting tomorrow for work, and she has to leave really early, so I'm going to my aunt's house to sleep over tonight, and I'm really excited because she has a big hot tub, and I just can't wait to take a bath in it, but that's pretty much it, um, so I hope you guys like this vlog, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!